The biggest preconception I had about university was that I might not fit in, I might not meet people like me, and that I might struggle to receive support. My preconception about university was that everyone's sort of like a party animal, but what I've really realised is that people are actually very focused on their education, which sort of makes sense because we're at university, right? I really felt like I didn't deserve to be at work when I first came and it was hard to learn that self-worth and learn like you did get here for a reason and you do deserve to be here. The community at work was really, really supporting. I found like a lot of friends. Um, initially, I was a bit afraid because I'm kind of an introvert, but once you find one person, you end up finding like a whole load of people. I'm a big stay in my room person, so I guess joining a society forced me to kind of get out of my comfort zone, get out of my room, and just like be active and do things within the work community. When I started university, I was most surprised by the community. Feeling accepted was really important to me, and it wasn't until I did develop that confidence through societies and through meeting my peers and doing work experience and things like that that I really felt that not, I hadn't just found my place at Warwick, but also like built my personality a lot as well and my confidence. The difference between A-levels and degree, they're kind of incomparable in my opinion. A-levels, you're taught information, you're taught to take that in and regurgitate it. And when you come to university, you're actually, for the first time in my life anyway, I got to actually critically analyse the information that was being told to me. I'm dyslexic as well, so I had to really learn to be more organised with my time and be more efficient with my time. But once I figured that out, it was okay. I was able to find the balance between like social life, academics and sleeping because I love sleep. <laughs> Thinking back to those first few weeks, I didn't realise how much I would bring as a mature student. You bring a lot of life experience um, and you're not afraid to contribute and you have a slightly different perspective on things. And I think that adds value to the learning environment. Um, I wish I'd have known that before I started. I might have been a little less nervous. The support networks I reached out to were mainly my personal tutor and work wellbeing services. That was where like, I was able to get my late diagnosis of ADD finally. I think what's really important about support networks at Warwick is that they are there, but you need to take that first step to tell them you're struggling and then everything will come from that. I feel like as students, we don't really want to say we need help, but it's completely okay. When I started university, I wish I had known to just say yes to everything, um, give everything a go, even if I thought that something um, that I wouldn't enjoy something or that it wasn't quite me, whether that be societies or modules that I didn't think I would know about. I think getting as much information as possible and then giving it a go would be the best, the best advice I would give my younger self. This is basically a curiosity amusement park. And I say that in the sense that there are rides that you don't know that you will enjoy until you actually get on the ride. Just try it. You never know what you actually will end up liking.